Okay, um, good morning, y'all. How is everybody doing today, y'all? Um, I am on my way out. I have to go to Walmart. Um, I need to go get me some fruits and, and some energy drinks and, like, little, little, just little stuff. Yeah, because mind y'all, like, from what I've been dealing with, from what I've been dealing with and what I've been sharing with y'all, I just want y'all to know that I'm a fighter. Um, the same way I had to fight, I went through fighting breast cancer, and by the grace of God, I defeated that because of my love and my faith for God. Y'all, y'all, I just want y'all to understand. If I come to y'all with the with the with videos, um, if I come to y'all with videos that might be depressing, I just want y'all to know that um, God is with me. Um, I know I shared a video, video with y'all before and I was, I was telling y'all, no matter what happens, God is with me. And y'all, that's because I love him so much and that's because I'm a true woman of God. Y'all, um, if y'all haven't seen that video, y'all can go check it out. Um, I was explaining how I was almost in the car accident, and, but I had woke up there following morning. Just thanking God, thanking God, praising him. And I was like, <laughs> but anyway, yeah, if y'all haven't seen that video, go check it out. I'm just saying all that to say um, that no, what, no matter what happens to me in my life, God got me. He has full control over my life. I trust him completely with my whole heart. And so, like, right now, y'all, I'm just going, I'm not going through anything. The what I was sharing with y'all is just what I was sharing with y'all. I mean, of course, I, of course, there's, there's I mean, it's, I'm going through something, but it ain't nothing too hard for God. So, therefore, if it ain't too God, it's too hard for God, then I'm not supposed to be worried or stressed. So, that's what I'm trying to say. But my thing is, like I said, I still want to move. I've always wanted to move, honestly. I've always, always wanted to move. I've always wanted to see, like, a different type of landscape or a different type of, just a different scenery environment. So I, 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 I'm still going to try to go ahead and try to move y'all. But I just want to say thank y'all so much for watching y'all. I still, I'm still going to continue my YouTube. Like nothing is about to change. Um, I'm still trying to eat right, exercise, and y'all, because that part, I think, it's, I think if what it was the other day, everything just got overwhelming. I think with him, and then it was, it's hard trying to divorce him right now. That was giving me the runaround. And some woman, God bless her heart, everything that they was trying to do, like the paperwork, she was like, well, we can, we got to make you pay for this and pay for how many copies of that. This woman stepped in and she was like a guardian angel. Everything, every piece of paperwork that I needed to get my divorce done by the grace of God, hallelujah, she gave it to me for free. Told me how to fill it out. She helped me. She didn't just give me give me she just didn't tell me stuff and send me off she gave me steps she guided me and i knew i hugged her the, yesterday and y'all i just started crying and she took her glasses off and i could tell she wanted to cry with me but y'all i be when i cry i don't want nobody to be like it's a sense of it's a sign of weakness now when i cry i'm crying because i'm upset about something and i know whatever it is i'm upset about I'm going to give it to God and let him handle it because I know I can't take, take it on my own. And sometimes I do be wanting to take it up on my own. I got, y'all, yes, I need to get my chin in her. <laughs> I'm just a realist. Yes, I do have chin in her. I, I need to cut them. I cut chin in her because they say if you shave them, they say if you shave them, um, and they say that when women get, like multiple people get it, like I'm not the only one. But they say it could be like a sign of wisdom or something. But mine is too long. I'm going to have to go get some scissors and cut mine. But anyways, y'all. Um, uh, I'm glad that I can smile today. And I still have more paperwork uh, concerning my divorce. Um, so, yeah, y'all. I'm still going to focus on moving. I'm right now, I just need to get to Walmart. Because I'm going to start DIYing my dress today. Because I know I need to do something to uplift my spirits, y'all. But dealing with this paperwork, I, I literally get up and deal with my paperwork all morning. Like, all morning, I just sit in my driveway and tell y'all what I got to do. 
I get up and deal with my paperwork. I look up. I did. I didn't deal with my paperwork from eight eight o'clock all the way to two o'clock. I'm like, this is just paperwork. Why is it so hard? And it just didn't done on me that I've been do, trying to divorce this dude for for about eight months off and on, and they just been telling me, go get this paperwork, go get that paperwork. But this woman, I tell you, she was sent. She was God sent. This was she didn't send me nowhere. She gave me every piece, every packet I need, stapled it put paper clips on it. She took me to other places inside the courthouse who was supposed to be helping me. Like, once I filed my motion, I got, like, right now, y'all, I got two paperwork. I got two paperwork. I'm trying to show y'all what I have. I have two paperwork. I have a motion paper and something else and an order paper. Once I filled that out, she was like, I should be good. She told them people, go ahead and file it. She was like, go ahead and file this one with divorce. Because I was telling them, y'all ever seen that movie Enough with J-Lo? When people do it, people just think they can just mess with y'all just because you married to them. Like, that's how he feels. Like, you ain't just messing with me just because I'm still married to you, fool. Like, you better get a grip on reality. Anyways, y'all, I'm going to go ahead and go to the store. I'm going to try to give y'all different content today. This right here will be separate. Um, content from my uh, DIY project so I'm going to be doing two videos and I'm not wearing the same thing either because that throws me off but anyways y'all let me go ahead and go and I'm sorry I talked so much but I just want to keep y'all updated so yeah let's get back into me going to Walmart and getting what I need okay so y'all y'all do know that they always play music in here so um I'm going to go ahead and um, speed it up, speed the video up, and come back. I'm just going to just give y'all the haul, and I'm going to go from there. So, y'all, like I said, like, share, comment, subscribe if y'all haven't already. I just want to say thank y'all, thank y'all, thank y'all so much because, y'all, I understand. I know, I, I know I'm on the, uh, I know that I'm on the, um, the Walmart store run part of the haul, but y'all got to understand. I understand clearly what God is doing in my life. He's trying to see if I'm going to continue to. Like with this move, it'll be an important move, and um, it'll be great for me. But he want to see if I can maintain everything. He want to see if I can make this move. God want to see if I can make this move and still focus on the things that he have for me to do for my life. So I understand completely what God is doing, y'all. But anyways, I'm gonna go ahead and speed this video up, y'all. Get what I need, and I'll see y'all in the next clip. Enjoy. But uh, thank y'all so much. Um. Even the people who subscribing and unsubscribing, unsubscribing, thank y'all, thank y'all, thank y'all. Y'all my brothers and sisters in Christ. I love y'all all. And yeah, let's get back into the vlog. You know the drama is never ending. Don't let it get the best of you. And all the fake friends just keep pretending. That's how the little things get.
y'all. So I've been home for a while. I just had to let my camera charge. Y'all, I know I don't want nobody to be like, girl, do you? I, I do. Let me tell you something. I don't believe in all the mood swings. And, I mean, I believe in mood swings. People just have good days and bad days. I don't think that's a diagnosis. You will have ups and downs regardless. Those, that's what's called trials and tribulations. So psychologically, I don't believe in all that. But I just, I'm just saying that to say, y'all, that I am, I am good. I'm just going through some trials and tribulations, and I'm being my faith in God is being tested to see if it's going to waver. And guess what, y'all? Your girl is not going to waver in her faith. I'm not going to crumble. I'm not going to lay down and take nothing. Y'all, I am going to press my way through like I did all the other times I have been going through my trials and tribulations. I'm going to continue to believe in my God, continue to worship Him, praise Him in and out of season, good times and bad. So, y'all, I want to get, I just said I'll let to say because... I just I'm, I'm I just want y'all to know that this is like is a quick life update, but it's also like a haul because like I said, ain't nothing gonna stop me. The devil he trying, but he ain't gonna stop nothing that God has planned for my life. So anyway, y'all, I'm gonna go ahead and give y'all a quick haul. Um, I have okay, so y'all know I'm still trying to eat healthy first of all because um. Let me see because because of the stuff that, that that's been going on, it had been try, it had been trying to cause me a little stress. But I noticed that I this is the time God want me to trust Him the most. So that's why I got to keep doing what I'm doing and not letting nothing affect, you know, my faith. So um, with that being said, y'all, I still been trying to eat healthy because I know it's gonna um, <clears throat> help me out in the long run. I know that if I stress out or it get like an instant depression, I'm gonna start eating crazy. I'm going to start putting on unhappy weight, and I'm going to be unhappy, and that's going to be in a depressed state of mind. So knowing that, I went and got some uh, some things that I know that I can eat that would keep me, um, that if I was to eat, you know, and, and I did have a mommy or something, I, it's, just stuff, it's just stuff that I can eat that won't put a lot of weight on me, you know. So, anyways, y'all, I went by cravings also. That's another thing. I tried to be smart and go by cravings. So, I got, um, for, for, like, my little tangy cravings, I got some pickles. I got some, um, kosher baby deals for my spicy craving. I got some spicy pickles. Okay, I know I need energy. I always need energy. So, I got me some strawberry lemonade. Um, I got me some, um... Strawberry Lemonade V8 Energy Drinks. And so, um, I got some Cran Apple Juice because, my I don't know, my niece turned me on to that. And she was like, girl, it helps you. It's good. It tastes good. And, y'all, I honestly love them frozen. If you get some Cran Apple and put it in the freezer, and I'm telling you, it make it eat it like it's a snow cone, you will love it. Okay, now I got me some uh, Sunbell um, Chocolate Chip. Um bars it's a 15 count i got me a um snack tray just meat cheese crackers pepperoni um because i know i'm gonna need some protein so i had to get the pepperoni okay of course i got my my candy because i have sour taste i got some i got me two cans of i actually got three because it's cans in the back of these cans for y'all see so i got me some pineapple chunks and some pineapple slices it's just different brands. Okay, I have yellow nectarines. I'm not quite sure why I got that spicy guacamole because I didn't pick up nobody's chips. I did pick up my uh, 50% less bait um, um, crunchy Cheetos because I be having like, I be even having a crunchy, <laughs> a crunchy craving. I be like, dang, what can I eat? Like a chip that's just gonna give me a good crunch. And I got me some bananas. Uh, I got me some more potatoes. And I got me some light Greek yogurt. So, yeah, this is part of my haul. This is the stuff that um, will be, these are some healthy cravings. The pickles may not be healthy, but, you know, it's going to satisfy, like, my, my, my sour craving, my spicy craving. But everything else is pretty much okay to eat. But like I said, y'all, I know I'm looking a mess, but right now, that doesn't even matter. I just want y'all to know that I am good. I don't want y'all to think I'm not good. I am good. Like I said, I'm still going to uh, uh, go ahead and process and try to work on, like, 
go on with my divorce. Try to, I'm going to go on and continue to move. And yeah, I'm good. And I'm going to be doing another video later on. I pray, y'all. I pray that I'm able to do this video because I do have to go out in the heat. And hopefully I just I can just turn this paperwork in. And yeah, I'm just trying to do everything. And then, like I said, I'm not going to lie. There was some stress because, y'all, it wasn't just my um, ex-husband is trying to get a divorce. It's other family matters, you know. It's like family matters. And, you know, you don't, like I said, you don't, you gotta, I gotta take time out for myself, invest time for myself. I can't let nobody else's problem be my problems. I cannot let, don't let nobody else's problems be your problems. It's all right to help, help people, but at the same time, too, you gotta help those who help themselves. You gotta, and if, especially if they're not learning, they constantly, 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 constantly doing stuff and not learning. And, like, I don't have time for that. At this point, I'm just trying to move on with my divorce and move on to a whole nother different scenery. And y'all, your girl gonna keep doing YouTube. I'm gonna keep on being happy. I'm gonna keep on praising God. And yeah, y'all, that is it for this vlog. Like, share, comment, and subscribe if y'all haven't already become part of the All About Jazz Family YouTube channel. And yeah, I'll see y'all in the next video. I'm out. Peace.